Uh, I'm going to spray my, my window thoroughly and this is going to tackle any glue that's left behind. Sometimes you have films and different brands do different things and, and, and it might be in different um, states of deterioration. You may have more glue on your glass. But this chemical will just about soften this glue up to where it effortlessly comes off. Now I'm going to tell you the big secret here, okay? The big secret is to have a sharp blade. Do not get one that's slightly used. You might even go through several blades per glass. And now that's the second biggest tip. The first biggest tip, and don't forget this, you've got to keep the glass wet. Don't let it dry. If you run across a dry patch, it will do you no good. Now this sharp blade combined, this chemical probably needs a minute to kind of react with the glue so it makes it soft. You see how it just pulls that glue right off effortlessly. I'm gonna come back to that little corner where I had a little piece of tent still left. So I'll go across the top. Start just getting the glue off. And then I'm gonna start working my way down real gent I mean just I, I don't put a lot of pressure, just medium pressure. You see that glue coming right off? I mean it's this is the secret. Sharp blade, wet glass. If your glass dries out, you better stop what you're doing. You better spray it again. Because that will keep your blade sharp, it'll keep your blade moving, it'll it'll bust right through the glue and it'll come off completely where you run this blade, if, if you do it this way. Okay, I'll show you two more tricks. Okay, now I've just scraped the glass. I've got most of the glue off. I mean, I'm happy with this. I'm gonna wet my glass again. I'm not gonna wet it really heavy because I've got another trick. I always like to take a quadruple alt steel wool and I like to just rub it down on the edge, the top. I, I got a little bit of medium force on this. Anything I might have missed with a blade, I'm, I'm sure to get it with this. <coughs> don't, don't breathe chemicals directly. You might cough. Okay, that's step one, or that's the next step I like to do. Here's the last step I like to do. There's always that hidden glue in the cracks, and you, if you ever wonder how I get it off, I have this Ulfa blade. Sometimes I use my cheaper plastic ones, but I actually retract my blade maybe four, five, or six clicks, and I press the blade up against the glass and into the crack, and I run it down. That's a pretty cool trick. I mean, I can get stuff that you can't see that might find its way back in the next film, and I might do it on the sides too, or another place I can't reach. And, and here's another trick too, that if you don't have an awful blade, I, I'm gonna show you another trick. Okay, this is the offset blade technique. It's one of my favorites because I get kind of lazy sometimes. I don't want to have to go fishing through my tent apron to find my awful blade, hoping that I've got a blade already in there long enough to do this. And, and a quick way for me is just to keep the scraper that I've already got in my hand, offset the blade a little bit, and watch this. I can get all the way in the cracks of the uh, window work. I'm now going to take my blade, I am going to stuff it in this crack, and I'm going to work it all the way down to get any glue I might have missed, and I'll do it on the other side as well. That's a pretty cool trick.